Hi, this is Godslayer. Well, we've made it through every stage in every stage in Mega Man. Cut Man, Guts Man, Elect Man, Dr. Wily, Ice Man, Fire Man, Bomb Man. Wait, did I just say Dr. Wily? Nope, that's <coughs> that's not right. We need to fight Dr. Wily yet. We haven't made it through him. Look at his eyebrows. He's got some amazing eyebrow prowess. Look at him go. And he's got a spaceship, his own personal spaceship. Very nice. Alright, so we're gonna go into Dr. Wily's stages. Most games shows a castle montage before that. That must start in the second game. Um, so oh yeah, that's right. I have zero lives left, so you know what? I'm just gonna I'm gonna eat it right now. Pow. Pow. Alright. Why? Because I need all the lives I can get on the stage. At the end is the, um, at the end is the, the monster, the, the rock or whatever monster that, that, um, that transforms his body into little pieces and flies across the screen. So you got to be really careful with that guy. All right. So. Uh, what else? I forgot. Something else about Mega Man. Oh, yeah. Uh, it's been mentioned about a million times about the cover of this game. Yeah, the cover was ridiculous. I think he's actually holding, like, a gun or something. I mean, his arm is a gun. Although this, his... And I was talking about that before. His arm's a gun, but look at me right now. I'm using... I'm throwing. So he must have, like... Obviously, he has switching capabilities. But in any case, he doesn't use a gun. His arm is a gun. Uh, that was not the right. That was not the right. Cut me. Iceman. See, I keep. I'm tired. I'm thinking that C is cold. I shouldn't be tired right about now, but. Alright. Oh, okay. I I don't hate that part. I find that part really annoying, though. Alright, so yeah, we're in Wily's castle. Let's just go ahead and call it that, because it is. We all know it is. It might be his... Well, let's just say it's his warehouse. This is the first game. It could be his warehouse. Who knows? Alright. There we go. Alright, I'll, I'll show a trick that's fun. Um... Yeah, the items respawn, they regenerate just by going off screen. So, oh, well, that's alright. Um, anyway, that's how you can refill your health right at that point. What you're gonna need, because obviously there's. I have no idea what you can do to avoid being hit right there. I think nothing. I wonder if there's any fanboys who try to, like, go through this with one hit. They must be extremely frustrated by that part. There's always an addendum. One hit. Well, I mean, uh, with no hits. Or no hits. Except for that one, because, you know, you can't avoid it. I think right now, yeah, we're at... I don't like this part either. Not fun. I hate these... I hate these pl bullet shooting platforms. It's always a guessing game. Whether they're going to shoot you and knock you off or not what their patterns are. Alright, well that was actually very easy this time, luckily enough. Uh, I guess I could have refilled Guts Man. I just always assume that I'm not going to need any of these weapons anymore. But, um... I don't think that they refill after each stage now, so gotta be careful. Oh, shoot, okay. So, I have no idea what you're supposed to do there. Um, s supposing that you're A, either out of M power, or B, um, you, you, uh, don't have the M weapon, I don't know. I guess you die and go back, and you can pick the stages again, so you gotta go back and find it, I suppose. Alright, so, now we're at this rock monster, considered one of the hardest bosses of all time, video game or so. I agree, I think it's really, really hard. Um, 
We'll do our best. It does have a pattern, but you've got to make sure you keep one step above him. Uh, that was pointless. Hmm. Well, unless I perfect, I'm not going to win this time, but that's all right. Huh. Yeah, that was that. All right, well, you got to make sure you keep <coughs> one hit above the amount of hits he hits you. Because using the electricity power, you hit him, you both hit each other for equal damage. So, yeah, that's it. Simple, right? Just, you know, like race him to destruction. The destruction race. He flies in. He kills you. You try again. It's fun. Oh yeah, there is a secret for this. Um, and I don't want to use it because I don't think I need to. Uh, what the secret is, is apparently if you hit um, select if you hit select or start rapidly as soon as the electricity connects then um, it'll glitch out the game, and the game thinks you hit him a lot of times. Very similar to Blaster Master. When on some of the bosses in Blast Blaster Master, you could use the same trick with the grenades. But as I said, I don't think I need to use it. So far, so good. Two more, and it'll be a perfect match. That would be nice. Nope. Not perfect, but that's okay. Just a boring, normal match, then. But this should be the last hit. So you can see, this is a strategy to get through it. A bunch of very precisely timed jumps. That's what. That's all you gotta do. Wow, he exploded, yet his shadow remained. You beat him so hard that you blasted his shadow into the wall. Alright, so that's... um. Ah, excuse me. That's uh that's the first stage. All right, let's take a look next time at the second stage of Dr. Wily's castle. See you later. I'm Godslayer. Bye-bye.